Okay, I got the Bedini top uh, stabilized the way I want it, and it's running real good. And uh, I could make a, a permanent model of this and confident that it would run uh, as long as I wanted it to. Anyway, it's uh, I call it the Bedini top, and uh, what it is is it's a top. I think I showed in the last video that I took apart and I put a, a ball magnet with a north-south facing out. At the top of the top, I've got a little neo magnet, and then on this little support arm here is another neo magnet right there, north south facing, and they uh, they uh, hold the top upright so it's stable, and then inside the bowl there is the Bedini coil. It's actually a tri filer on this setup here. And it stabilizes. It's uh, like I say, it's it's set up like this. And I've actually got this at an angle. You can see to tip the top a little bit so that it triggers the coil better. And uh, that triggers that coil a little bit better, having that top tipped a little bit. And it's stabilized there. But yeah, this works pretty darn good. Um, this is a source uh, battery over here. And I'll show you what it sounds like here. That's the thing running away. That's the coil firing inside. That's the little LED that uh, shows the, the firing on the uh, third winding of the Bedini coil. And that's the charged battery right there. So anyway, yeah, this, uh, this is stable now. Like I say, I could make a permanent uh, you know, structure like this now and be confident that it would run this stably. And the top is now stable. Um, pretty neat. I think this is a pretty neat setup here, and like I say, I call this the Bedini top, and it's all part of Johnny Davros and another guy, Irotat, or I don't know how you pronounce this, his name, but we've been working on this, Xenomorph's been working on it too, and uh, this is how I got this stabilized here. It's almost a magnetic levitation at this point, and I've got uh, a Teflon uh, lubricant that that is running on, so it should run a long, long time without wearing out the bottom of that top. So, you know, it doesn't make any noise either. So, pretty neat. Pretty neat stuff. Happy with that one. I'm getting ready to wind up this coil here as a bifiler and run a uh, ball magnet, the same one that's in that over there, ball magnet inside that coil, and it will turn up major, major RPMs uh, when I get that done. That's the latest.